Hello from Seoul? Yeah, we've done so many kinds of rice bowls, so I'm pretty sure you already have lots of good recipes in your personal cookbook. But if this is not in your book, then you're missing out on one of the most satisfying rice bowls of all time. Alright, are you guys ready? Let's get started! Today, we're gonna be making a chicken rice bowl with gochujang, Korean chili paste. It's super simple and delicious. It's gonna be a great lunch, dinner, or even your meal prep. I guarantee it. For this, you will need some chicken, onion, garlic, ginger, chili pepper, green onion, and a bowl of hot rice. That's it. So simple, right? But if there's only chicken and rice, you'll be a little sad, right? So with this chicory, let's make muchim, a Korean-style salad. What? You can't get this? Don't worry about it. Add the leafy greens, garlic chives, or even cucumber will totally work. So just pick anything you want and try it. Trust me, everything will be fantastic. First, let's talk about our chicken. Today, I'm gonna be using 300 grams of boneless skinless chicken breast and the same amount of chicken thighs. Because if we only use chicken breast, it can be a little dry and tough. Yeah, the fat from the chicken thighs will make it more moist and flavorful. And we're gonna be missing them later, but if that sounds like too much work for you or you wanna make this much easier and faster, then just get some ground chicken from the supermarket. Yes, that was my plan, but... It was sold out, dang it. Anyways, to mince them more easily, let's pop this in the freezer while prepping our vegetables. First, thinly slice some green onions and separate the whites and greens. The whites are gonna be stir-fried for beautiful aromatic oil and the greens are gonna be used for garnish. Next, finely dice a quarter of an onion. Since we're gonna cook it with ground chicken, if it's too chunky, there might be some kind of imbalance in texture. So make sure to finely dice it. And then smash 5 cloves of garlic and finely chop them. What? You wanna get more authentic Korean vibe? Then bring more garlic here. 10, 15, 20, it doesn't really matter. But if you're using 1 or 2, nobody will say that's Korean style. So please use more than 5 cloves of garlic. That's the key. And once that's done, grate a small knob of ginger. About 1 teaspoon will be enough. Lastly, thinly slice some chili peppers. Actually, these guys are mainly for color, so I'm just gonna use some mild chilies here. But if you're a big fan of spicy food, then get yourself some Cheongyang chili pepper or bird's eye chilies. But don't call my name with the effort in the bathroom the next day. Now let's move on to the sauce. In a small container, add 2 tablespoons of Korean chili pepper flakes, 3 tablespoons of gochujang, Korean chili paste, 1 tablespoon of soy sauce, 1 and a half tablespoons of oyster sauce, 1 and a half tablespoons of sugar, 2 tablespoons of mirin, and give it a good mix. That's it! So simple, right? But if you're worried that it's too spicy for you, then reduce the chili pepper flakes. Code brown situation? I'm not responsible. This time, let's make the dressing. In a small bowl, combine 1 tablespoon of Korean chili pepper flakes, 1 and a half tablespoons of vinegar, 1 tablespoon of sugar, 1 tablespoon of toasted sesame oil, half a tablespoon of toasted sesame seeds, half a tablespoon of minced garlic, 1 teaspoon of fish sauce and give it a good mix. What? You don't like fish sauce? Don't worry about it. It's not gonna be fishy at all, but full of umami. So don't be afraid. Alright, finally, let's prep our chicken. Take the chicken from the freezer and finely mince it. But like I said before, if it sounds like a hassle, get yourself some ground chicken or put it in a food processor. But in that case, freeze it for at least 20 minutes. Otherwise, you're gonna have very mushy chicken at the end. Alright, everything is ready to go. Let's get cooking. In a wok or pan, add 2 tablespoons of oil and heat it over high heat. Once it gets nice and hot, add the minced chicken, spread it out and just leave it in the pan for about 2 minutes. When the chicken is nicely browned on the bottom, flip and stir fry it for about 4 minutes. Once the chicken is cooked and most of the liquid has evaporated, stir in the white part of the green onions, onion, garlic, ginger and stir them around for about 2 minutes. 
when the fat from the chicken thighs meet our lovely aromatics, that will create an amazing flavor and fragrance. And that will take you to the next level. So if you're just using chicken breast and you couldn't get enough fat like this, then add some more oil. Or when mincing the chicken, you could also include the chicken skin. Anyways, once the garlic turns nice golden brown, pour the sauce we made and give it a good stir for about 2 more minutes. And then grab a spoon, give it a quick taste and add more salt to taste. Alright, let's turn the heat off. And to that, add the rest of the green onions, chili peppers, some black pepper, 1 tablespoon of toasted sesame oil and give that a final mix. That's it, super easy, right? Alright, just set that aside and let's finish our salad. Take some chicory and tear them into bite-sized pieces. And then pour on the dressing and give it a nice gentle toss. Yes, I said gentle. If you don't take my advice and squeeze it, you will see some kind of wet grass in your backyard. That's a disaster. Finally, it's time to assemble. Let's get some rice on a serving plate. And add a generous amount of our chicken stir fry and some salad. And for a prettier presentation, let's finish it off with some soft boiled egg and toasted sesame seeds. How does it look? It looks fantastic, right? Alright, let's call our taste tester. Claire? Mmm! It's so good! presentation man. So gorgeous! Let's give it a try! Before we try the main star of the show, let's try this salad first. It's gonna stimulate my appetite. Oh, Christmas tree처럼 예뻐. Oh, 새콤새콤 맛있겠다. Cheers. 음, 역시 탁월한 선택이었어. 음, 새콤하니 너무 맛있네. 음, 입맛을 잘 끌어줘. 이 무침 소스는 그냥 진짜 만능이야. 어떤 야채가 들어와도 딱 그냥 그만의 매력을 잘 살려주는 것 같아. 너무 맛있다. 괜찮네. 음. 음, 맛있어. 아, 맛있어. 밥이랑 같이 먹을까? I think it's so pretty in here. Cheers! 음, 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 맛있다. 아, 고추장으로 해서 그런지, 그냥 뭐, 그냥 맛있는데? 음! 일단, 고추장을 베이스로 해서 그런지, 이 자체가 되게 풍미가 가득하게 맛있고, 거기다 마늘의 향도 되게 세게 나는 데다가, 생고추를 넣어가지고 되게 맛이 풍부해졌어. 아, 그리고, 시중에 있는 그런 간고기를 쓴 것보다, 직접 이렇게 다져서 쓰니까, 입자들의 크기가 되게 불규칙해서, 훨씬 먹었었을 때, 식감이 더 재미있고, 씹는 맛도 더 추가되는 느낌이야. 음, 맛있네. 이 부리또 같은 데다 넣어서 먹어도 엄청 맛있겠다. 음. 약간 제육볶음 먹는 느낌도 있어가지고 이 치커리랑 같이 먹으면 쌈싸 먹는 느낌이 제대로 날것 같아요. <웃음> 음. 같이 먹어야 진짜 이 궁합이 예술이네. 조합을 잘하라. 음, 잘 어울려. 같이 먹어야 더그 매력이 상승하는 것 같다. 이 고추장 소스에 없는 그 약간의 그 탱이 있지. 그걸 이 치커리가 딱 매워줘. 그래서 진짜 맛을 더 풍부하게, 맛있게. 다 갖출 수 있게 만들어주는 것 같아. 음, 너무 맛있다. 약간 김치 같은 느낌도 있어가지고 집에서 김치 뚝 떨어져 썼을 때 후드드닥 만들어서 먹어도 재기육일 것 같아. <웃음> 음, 마지막으로 계란을 이 녀석들과 같이 한번 먹어보겠습니다. 좀 크지만 할수 있다. You can go wrong with this. So good. 남은 반죽도 가져와. <laughs> Today, I showed you how to make a spicy Korean chicken rice bowl. How was it? It's unbelievably easy and looks delicious, right? Like I said earlier, this bad boy will take care of lunch, dinner, and even your meal prep. So once you try, I'm 100% sure you'll be so satisfied. I guarantee. Alright, this is it for today, and I'll see you next time.